I'm Troy Kirby with MLT News with a quick look at the 2021 Washington State Legislative Session. The Senate's Early Learning and K-12 Education Committee held a public hearing on January 22nd for Senate Bill 5136, which would prohibit fees for child care licenses in the wake of the COVID-19 pandemic and its devastation on the child care industry. COVID, WCCA has been advocating for direct grants to providers, access to affordable health care, and priority for vaccines for the early learning workforce. We appreciate this bill as it, ad it addresses a financial burden that the legislature has the ability to eliminate for providers. At this time of economic challenge, eliminating licensing fees for child care providers is a step towards uh, supporting the industry during a time when they critically need it. I, I'm struggling to think of another group of people who are licensed who don't have any who don't have any fee for the license. Uh, when you look at the industry itself, it was not created with a business model. And we know that providers themselves are not making living wage jobs. We also know it's an industry that predominantly is run by women. Also heard was Senate Bill 5184 concerning K through 12 liaisons and points of contact for children in the state foster care system. Students in foster care are some of our most at-risk students. They face higher risk of poverty, homelessness, incarceration, early parenthood, and substance abuse when they leave the foster care system. I know this because I um, experienced foster care and fell victim to many of those statistics. Who reside in foster care. The passing of Senate Bill 5184 is imperative because building points of contact are critical and help assist with foster care liaison, myself, with identifying individual student needs at the building level. Thank you for watching the Daily Legislative Report by MLT News, covering the 2021 legislative session.